Well, we got some graduates. In fact, we got a few that's been around for a while. Oh, yeah, Peter, yeah. Not as long as you, though. Daniel. but sometimes they <clears throat> forget. Alex. It, it's, a, it's a blessing to be here. It's been a whole year since I've been here, exactly a year. So bef before, when I came in here, I was just, you know, I was, I was lost, I was hopeless. But now that God's been working in me, it's just been such an amazing process. He's been putting me through. So uh, I would say that first phase was me rediscovering my relationship in Christ. Second phase was more of um, finding my identity in Christ. And now, now that I'm going to staff for PDC... Uh, it's just, I just want to serve. I just want to give back because God has restored my life. He's just gave me new hope, and it's just a, such a blessing to be here. So. How about you? you know, most of the staff upstairs went through church on the street. Isn't that tremendous? Man, I think that is unbelievable. It's God, we're just letting God be God. Besides, this little rascal. He's graduating with us. myself back together, you know, second phase was, you know, through it, all, through it all, you know, it was just a, a process of getting my relationship back with God, building up my faith again, and my strength, you know, and just finding things in myself that I never thought was there, you know, especially um, Christ, you know. Um, um, uh, first things first, you know, I just want to thank God, you know. I, before I came here, I prayed that if he could take me to a place away from home where no one knew me, where I didn't know anybody, and, you know, he, he brought me here, so I, I just thank God for that, you know. Yeah. And, and I want to thank God, Mr. Lee and Pastor Walt, you know, you guys are truly a blessing, not, not just me, but for everybody here, and, you know, I just, closing the next chapter and opening the new chapter in my life. Amen. And, you know, changes are happening, and you know, I'm just excited about that. And I just praise God every day that He brought me here. And I'd just like to thank each and every one of you, and I want to encourage any, every one of you that um, um, no matter what it is that you're going through, you know, like through each outcome with Christ, there is victory. So just keep fighting. You can't have victory if you don't fight through your battles. Amen. Staff and PDC too. Also. Well, tell, tell you what, the natives are taking over. Good <laughs> <laughs> uh, try. White Mountain Apache. Yeah. Man, that's me. You know, it is so neat. You have no idea how the Native Americans, the enemies, really put them down. The reservations. Uh, Oh, I mean, just the, the wickedness. It's 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 that they're they're raised. They're spiritual, you know, guided by the, the spirits. By the way, they're, they're not guided by the spirits. But just to see, man, she's a tiger. 
Digress. <laughs> By the way, she's graduating honest too after the year. Um, because I just saw the growth within me. I flourished so much here within these past nine months that um, I've been here from the first time that I was here. And I see within me, God has completely done a huge, amazing work within inside me that it's, you know, just awestruck because when I was first here the first time, I was mean. I'm not going to lie, I was mean. I was really, really mean, and God... Are you a native? Yes. <laughs> yeah, I'm from a Tohana Atham. Um, we used to be called Papago, but that's my tribe, you know. So, um, yes. <laughs> We're, you know, we just... A lot of people from my reservation don't live off their reservation, so when they hear that I'm, you know, T.O., they're just like, what? And I'm just like, ah. So, I mean, it's just, I would like to go out there, too, as well, because, you know, it's like, they're 20 to 30 miles away from the Mexico border. So we have a lot of coyotes and people from that side coming in, trafficking drugs and women and children. And it's just, I would like to start something out there. Amen. PDC staff as well, and uh, I'm going to be with the Hope Wing. Not my girls, not my love, you know, and I'm going to be one of their house moms. No. Amen. You see me. You say you love them. But they're going to worry you're going to scalp them. <laughs> no, 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 I can't do that. I'm going to show them the love. A lot of they got you. <laughs> they got you. <laughs> Praise the Lord. And she's graduating with honors too. times we're out there uh, feeding uh, the homeless yeah and they put me in a, a worship slash preaching so it's some good stuff yeah preach all right if you have your bible let's turn to uh, deuteronomy 7 9 uh, well, just a minute okay here it goes Know therefore that the Lord your God, he is God, the faithful God, who keeps his covenant and his loving kindness to a thousand generations with those who love him and keep his commandments. And I just want to tell you that God is definitely holds his end of the, of the bargain. I made a covenant with God to be here six months. And a lot of times I fell. A lot of times I couldn't hold my end of the bargain. But God held his own. Yeah. 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 God's a good God. Amen. 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 Do do now? Job, I'm going to go second phase. Hopefully, there's some worship and sit with us. Pastor Kevin and John and myself came from a ministry. It's kind of they weren't right, but they weren't too too wrong. Called the door. And when I found out about that, you know. They, they instilled some good stuff in us, but they got a little radical. But, it's amazing how God can make all things work together for good. When I found that out, and then I 
heard him singing and he did all the praise and worship up in Galilee. But I'm going to tell you something. You're learning me there. No, no so let's just see how God's going to use him. How God's going to use you. Right? No, he, he's not fancy. He did not graduate with honor. <laughs> but he graduated. <laughs> Is your dad here? Yeah. Get your dad to stand up. Maybe if we get a chance to talk to him. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Well, God bless you. Okay, I didn't want.